Today we are deep in the southernmost tip of the Appalachian Mountains fishing what I consider to be some of the prettiest trout water I've ever seen. Wild trout literally do not exist any further south in the eastern U.S. Welcome to North Georgia. Oh, that's a big boy. Giant fish, giant! Giant! All right guys, good morning. So, welcome back to North Georgia. Um, I are currently, finally, officially starting the North Georgia Trout Series Part 2. So we did a part one last year. We basically fished a bunch of new water and we're kind of just like exploring rivers and creeks more than anything. So what we're gonna focus on this year is really catching some big trout. So this is our first official weekend, full sending for big public water wild brown trout. So our goal for this set of video, for the brown trout set of the North Georgia series, is to catch a 20 inch plus inch wild brown on public water. That's the goal. I don't know how long it's going to take. Hopefully we can do it pretty easily. If not, we're going to be fishing quite a bit in the next upcoming month or two. So stay tuned and let's get to the river. John, got one. Gonna fall over. Not a real big one, but it's a fish. There we go. All right, guys. My first branch of the day, I've probably uh, seen probably like 15 or so. I just, they just, just hit and I just can't hook them. But first brown trout, not a huge one, but not too bad either. Pretty colors. Very pretty fish. I'm gonna get him released and hopefully catch a couple more before it starts raining. At the end of the day. <laughs> yeah. Serious? God, boss, I got a big one. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I can't do anything. I literally can't do anything. I need you now. I guess I can maybe try to get this off. <laughs> Dude, I got stuck on this and it was literally on top of the water and he came up and hit it. I was trying to flick it off this dang bush. I wasn't even looking at the fish. All right guys, so just caught my first fish of the day. I haven't had nearly as much, uh, haven't seen nearly as many fish as Andrew, but I threw in here and as you guys saw on the GoPro, I got stuck on a tree and I was like trying to wiggle it free and a brown trout came and about jumped out of the water for it. Probably 14-ish. Whoa, buddy, he's a pretty guy. Look at this fella. Just a gorgeous brown trout all around. So we'll go ahead and get a release on this guy and then continue up fishing. Hopefully catch a 20 here in a little bit.
Two fish in one hole, it's a miracle. It's a nice one, boys. It's the biggest of the day. It's probably, what, 15-ish, give or take. I got my thing in there. It's probably 15-ish, around there. He's a cutie. I guess I'll get an underwater release since I don't think Andrew's coming. Andrew and I ended the hunt for a big brown trout early that day to fish some new water. It just didn't seem like the bigger fish in the river were all that active. After a few months, I was able to find time to return and fish with a few buddies of mine to continue the hunt for a big wild brown. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. So, I'm supposed to be meeting Cole and Tyler here at eight o'clock. Well, not here, here, but we're supposed to be meeting them at eight o'clock. It's 7.30. Um, basically, I just woke up really early for absolutely no reason. I couldn't get back to sleep. So I did two things. A, I located some turkeys, some gobblers, um, which I'm a little bit jealous of these guys down south because their turkey season's already in, and my turkey season doesn't come in for another, like, oh, I don't know, three weeks or something like that. And then the second thing I've done is I've got to watch this freaking awesome sunset. So I'm gonna drive to where I have to meet them and meet them and we're gonna fish a very remote backcountry section of a creek today. A creek that I've fished before but I've not fished all the way through it. So it's gonna be fun. Hopefully we're gonna catch some really nice brown trout. I think the plan is to mostly throw streamers all day unless it just absolutely backfires. So stay tuned and I hope you guys are gonna enjoy this video. Light streamer might be the money. Well, we'll see. <coughs> oh God. On this cast right here. Shit, dude. Oh yeah, buddy. Oh yeah, buddy. Hold him on. Oh my. Hold him on. He ain't got dude, a that's a big dude, fish. Got a net, dude. That's oh, a giant. Hey, can you bring him back down? Bring him back down if you can. I'll let him. That's a oh, that's a big boy. That's a giant. Can you walk him down there? Mm. I'll cross. Oh, buddy. Please stay hooked. Ah, uh, this is gonna be interesting. He's probably 17, 18. Dude, I was pulling up to recast. Hey, nah, because that's... Yeah, I'm not exactly sure, but if we can get somewhere where we can... Man, he is fighting. Yeah, he's probably the biggest one I've caught out of here. I don't want to hit you with it, but I can probably get it right too. Let me get back here to where there's less current. Oh shit. Alright. Hold on, let me get. Throw it in front of me. Like this? Yeah. Oh shit. Real point, dude. Maybe, if I can oh. get out to it. Here it comes, here it comes. I can't even reach it with my rod. He's just hooked on the back end. This is a nice fish. Get him up, get him up. Yep. I can't see him. Okay. Get him up, get him up. Oh, he went right in there. He is fighting so hard. I can't see him. We're good, we're good, we're good. 
Stick him in now. Go, 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 go. Oh, nice, buddy. God, yeah, what was that though? What was that the hardest thing that's ever happened? Yeah, I mean, he's nice. But he's Where's your net? Do you have your net? Is there much? Oh, there it is. Look at that. The colors on the fish are incredible. Jeez. I'm gonna hold up this fish real quick for you guys. Just so you can get a better look at them. Look at that fish. The colors are incredible. So I'm gonna go ahead and get them released fish. and then we'll continue on. We just literally just started fishing this river and we're doing good. Got him. Chill out, buddy. There you go. That's a decent brown right there, ladies and gentlemen. Nothing giant, but a nice fish for sure. Don't let him go to that log. Oh, shoot! <laughs> He's in the riffles. Pull his head up. Let's go, buddy. <laughs> Love to see it, dude. Get him on over here, dude. <laughs> All right. Hold that fish up real quick. Get a shot of it on here. This is Cole's fish right there. Look at this fella. What a gorgeous brown trout, man. That's incredible. Awesome color, dude. Yeah. Bulldogged it, too. That's awesome, man. Giant fish, giant, giant. Oh, it's a rainbow. It's a rainbow. I thought it was a big brown, dude. I know. Oh, I'm, I want to land it, but I thought that was a big brown. Holy sh! Oh, I'm not. I mean, I'm not upset. Uh, uh. Dude, why is that fish so pretty? Been in there wow, he's been in there for a minute. That's crazy, dude. Dude, have rainbows ever been cooperative? No. There we go. Look at him. Something took a chunk out of his fan. Yeah. He's been through it, that's for sure. Yeah, he has. Sweet. All right.
Good morning. So, I was supposed to be leaving today, but um, as you guys just watched, yesterday the fishing wasn't like amazing, but the fish we were catching were really solid. So instead of just leaving the t this morning and going back home, I decided I was going to fish some this morning and then just get home really late. Uh, just because the fishing was good and I feel like if I move some more water in through here, I have a good chance of catching at least another brown the size of the one I caught yesterday. So that's the plan. It is probably 7.30, 8 o'clock, somewhere in there. I've already hiked up around two miles and I'm just going to start fishing and just move as much water as I can with a big streamer and just hope that I can catch a decent brown trout. So anyway, that's the plan. Brewer's back there yonder. I'm going to get my waders on and start fishing. Nice brownie. Nothing giant, but it's a brownie. Chill out. There we go. Look at that. Decent fish. Nothing crazy, but I'll take what I can get at this point. Thanks, buddy. Looking for the big boys. Spoiler alert. I didn't find the big boys. I fished for several more hours and found some other browns, but nothing over that 15 inch range. But that's okay, because catching big brown trout isn't easy and it isn't supposed to be. If it was, everybody would do it. I quite honestly was supposed to go fish some bigger water to increase my chances at a bigger fish, but I ran out of time. Life got busy and because of limited free weekends, the Georgia series got put on hold. But I'd like to give a huge shout out to Cole and Tyler. Their Instagram handles are listed in the description. And of course, I'll be back soon looking for that wild Georgia 20. 